right, so today is the evening of day 20. Watching these two red-tailed catfish grow up. I've had them for almost three weeks now. This seems like <laughs> seems like I haven't had them that long. And take a look at this. Uh, if you notice the little white specks down on the bottom, I put some shrimp in there, some raw shrimp. Looks like they didn't eat it all. Looks like some of those pieces may be a little bit too big for them. So looks like the shrimp was kind of a... We ran out of blood worms, so I switched to shrimp. And look at how big he's getting already. <laughs> he's trying to hang out in the handle. <laughs> he can't quite fit in there. Oh, maybe he can. Oh, barely. That's pretty funny. <laughs> there he goes. So I'm definitely going to have to clean up that shrimp first thing. So I'm going to grab my net here. Do a little cleaning. Definitely don't want leftover food in there very long. So I've been feeding twice a day and cleaning up twice a day. So I ran out of blood worms. They were doing really good on blood worms. They were eating it like crazy. And I just switched to the shrimp. Uh, of course, I think I may have just put too much. I saw me eat a couple pieces of shrimp. But today I'm going to try beef liver. That should be pretty interesting. Boy, look at all that stuff down there. They're <laughs> getting kind of messy. Getting kind of messy. Oh my. Let's see here. This net is nice because it'll uh, clean the whole thing. Like almost screens all the water with <laughs> just a few swipes of this net. It's pretty amazing. Ah, that's a lot of stuff I got out that time. That net is pretty awesome. So I haven't had that net too long. It's been doing really good. All right, so we're going to try some beef liver. I cut it pretty small. Hopefully it'll sink. <laughs> we'll see. All right, so we'll see how they like the beef liver compared to everything else. I got a couple other things I can try after the beef liver. All right, so I'm going to put this in an underwater housing. Do a little underwater video and we'll see if these guys actually eat. Today is day 21 on these two little red-tailed catfish. 21 days since I bought them. And I bought them about two weeks old, so they're almost exactly five weeks old now. Assuming they were actually two weeks old when I bought them. All right, so let's take a look at these guys. You can tell one's sticking out of the, the handle over there. So that handle on the side 
it's exactly almost exactly three inches so we can kind of get an idea how how big these guys are every day he grows a little bit bigger so he's maybe three three point one three point two inches which is pretty crazy <laughs> he's like staying up by the filter uh, they are getting quite a bit bigger he's getting smarter too he's actually coming up the ledge and more often Come back up to the filter. I might have to pull this filter completely out uh, to feed these guys. All right, so first thing I want to do is clean up a little bit. And I started, not only do I clean up before I feed, but I've been cleaning up after I feed because it seems like even over here, it looks like we got some, still got some uneaten shrimp from two feedings ago, it looks like maybe which is not good definitely don't want extra food floating around in here want to keep the water as good as possible but this net makes <laughs> quick work cleaning up that's for sure all right so we got that cleaned up all right so today we're gonna to feed something different Take a look at this. This is chicken liver. First time feeding chicken liver. I fed the beef liver yesterday. Boy, they really like that beef liver. These are some pretty big chunks. <laughs> uh, let's see. They eat it a lot faster than the blood worms too. Wow, that stuff sinks quick. I think that's the fastest sinking food that we've had so far. All right, so I'm gonna put this camera in a waterproof housing and finish up with a little underwater video. 